Hi everyone, it's Sissy here. I don't know about you, but I absolutely love hot pot. I'm the kind of person I can eat hot pot like every single day. <laughs> Chinese people also really enjoy hot pot during any holidays and celebrations because it is so delicious. So today I'm going to share with you two must-eat hot pot soup bases. And to celebrate Chinese New Year, I'm partnering with Noor. They're having this really awesome sweep sticks. Let's take a look. To celebrate Chinese New Year, Noor is going to have an awesome sweep sticks. From January 5th to January 31st, there will be 10 winners. And those lucky winners will get 1,000 worth of kitchen supplies, including a high quality cast iron induction cooker and a super amazing gift basket. To enter the sweep ticks, use Noor Kitchen Broth Mix, Noor Liquid Seasoning, or Noor Bouillon Cubes, and cook your family's favorite Chinese New Year dish. Take a picture of this amazing dish and upload it to Noor's website. I will put the link in the description box. In a pan, transfer in the spices, cinnamon, star anise, cao guo, bay leaves, cloves, and over low heat, lightly toast until aromatic for about 2 minutes. Turn off the heat. Transfer the spices to a spice bag. We're also going to place in the onion and ginger. Tide it up and set aside. In a large pot of water over high heat, we're going to place the beef bones inside. In a grinder or food processor, add cinnamon, cao guo, star anise, Chinese liquor rice root, cloves, bay leaves, fennel seeds, Sichuan peppercorns, dry red chili peppers, and grind it. Transfer it to a bowl. Chinese people don't usually use paprika in Chinese dishes, but this is going to add a really beautiful red shade to it. That's why I'm using it. We're also going to add rice wine in it. The wine is going to help protect the spices from not getting burned so easily later. Give it a good mix and set aside. In the same grinder, we're going to add in a garlic and coarsely grind. We're also going to place in the black bean sauce and the Sichuan Pixian Dou Ban Jiang. 
Grind until it becomes a paste. So it is completely dissolved and bring it to a boil so when you eat your hot pot you can choose any kind of ingredients however way you want to eat it but for me i like to put in the items that you can cook for a long time first like all the fish balls and beef balls and some napa cabbage and tofu so things like beef slices you can just cook one at a time and you eat it dip it in the dipping sauce and just enjoy oh this is gonna be so delicious all right and i'm just gonna use another pair of chopsticks to eat Mmm. Absolutely amazing. It's numbling, it's spicy. Alright, I'm gonna try one fish tofu also. Mm. Okay, the deep broth, very simple, full of umami taste. The spicy one, full of excitement. It is so numbling and so spicy. Super delicious. Remember to take a look at North awesome sweepstakes. I will see everyone again next Friday. Remember to subscribe, thumbs up, and happy, happy Chinese New Year! <laughs>